Back here at home, the Texas Parks and Wildlife Department is warning Texans about an invasive crayfish from Australia. Now, the department says researchers recently found the first known introduction of the invasive Australian red claw crayfish in Texas. To give us a little more insight about the species, aquatic biologist Arches Grubb with Texas Parks and Wildlife joins us this afternoon. Thank you so much for your time. Hi. So the species with, why is it such a danger to native wildlife? So the <clears throat> Australian red claw crayfish is an exotic species and it's native to northern Australia and southern New Guinea and is among one of the largest freshwater crustaceans. Uh, due to its large size, it has the propensity to alter the habitat uh, by removing some of the aquatic vegetation. It can also uh, pose a threat to the native crayfish and some of the smaller fish species. Okay, and can you describe some of the features of the Australian red claw crayfish? Yeah, so this one's gonna be very hard to miss uh, when you see it. You know, it's like bluish greenish color with a distinct red patch along the edge of its claws. Uh, it also has about four uh, ridges going along the top of its head. Um, and it, it grows about nine inches or so in length uh, and about two pounds in size. Okay, so you said it's not too hard to spot. If you do spot it, what should you do? What should people do? Uh, so we are encouraging people uh, to report the spottings, the sightings uh, with the exact location and also as many clear pictures as possible. That's going to help us figure out how far uh, this exotic species is spread throughout South Texas. Okay, and then lastly, we had a few debates in the newsroom. It, crayfish, crawfish, crawdad, what's the best way to describe this? Um, you know, uh, I think in like technical terms, we refer to it as crayfish, but then just lovingly we call it crawfish, crawdaddies, mud puppies, and in this case, the Australian red claw, you know, they're known as yabbies, or you can even call it as the lobster, I guess. <laughs> okay, all right. Thank you so much for your time. We really appreciate it, and we appreciate the warning and the update that you're giving our viewers today. Thank you.